Peace in from the black holes of Dakota Toratory, the United States of Advancement of Skepticism. Stan Gibalisco here. I've made a series of videos about a company called V Support LLC, which, uh, I, as far as I'm able to tell on the internet and according to the Better Business Bureau, is a perfectly legitimate company with an A- rating, definitely to be trusted according to those sources, except for one uh, person who made a very negative comment, a suspicious comment about them, that they were a scammer that had changed their name after being investigated by the Federal Trade Commission. But that particular criticism came from someone associated with a competitor to V support uh, LLC. So I was very skeptical about that. However, in the end, skepticism took the day and I took my computer in and I'm going to have it wiped. I'm going to have the entire operating system reinstalled. All of the data uh, will be gone. Any malware that exists on the computer will be taken care of by these people. Whether it came from vSupport LLC or not, we'll never know. But skepticism took the day, and there were several events that made me highly suspicious myself, despite what I read on the Internet, which was almost entirely positive. I don't want to indict or accuse vSupport of anything. I have no evidence tangible evidence whatsoever that there's anything wrong with them. It's just my hunch, my deepening skepticism. The more I learn about the internet and technology, the more I realize that we as a society are placing ourselves in grave danger by relying too much on this medium of communication and interaction and that we are going to regret it only when we finally discover that it wasn't a very good idea. Coronal mass ejection, some sort of massive worm or malware, something's going to happen that's going to make us sorry we relied on this Internet so much. I don't want to be around to be harmed that much by that day, but I don't know what we can do about it. All we can do is try and educate ourselves and the public that this is a very, very risky medium we're dealing with, and we have to mitigate that risk to the greatest extent that we can. How exactly? I have ideas, but those are topics for other videos. For now, I have no indictment, no accusation against vSupport LLC, but I will say that something in me has alarm bells ringing all through my head. Maybe it's the benzodiazepines. Yeah, that's got to be it. Everything bad that happens to me has got to be the fault of the clonazepam. Nobody, uh, no other entities can possibly be at fault, can they? Stan Gibalisco saying peace out from the black holes of Dakota Toratory, United States of Advancement of Skepticism. Until next time, so long.